<laughs> Welcome back to the Jamaican Taste Buds Kitchen. My name is Aisha and today guys I have a delicious simple appetizer recipe for you. Guys right now it's the football season in America and guys today I will be making my mango henny wings. Yes guys everybody likes wings everybody likes mangoes and most of all everybody likes the NSC so guys if you want to know how I put the flavor of love into this recipe stay tuned for more yes the mango henny wings the mango henny wings <laughs> remember to subscribe like share and comment on this video and let me know what you think about my recipe today subscribe become family subscribe <laughs> okay guys so over here I have two dozen wings I'm gonna be deep frying one set of wings and I'm gonna be baking the other so I'm gonna show you two with how I make my mango Hennessy wings so over here guys I got some flour some cornstarch salt chicken seasoning all-purpose seasoning some garlic powder onion powder, some black pepper, and over here guys I have my Hennessy, my mango, my honey, butter, garlic, sugar, some mango chutney guys, got some mango chutney, and I got some barbecue sauce. So what I'm going to do now guys is just season up my chicken. On the wings to be baked I'm just gonna add a little bit of sugar contributes to the sweetness of the sauce now I'm just gonna season now I'm just gonna mix up each and just incorporate the seasoning does it right guys I'm just gonna I'm just gonna season the flour and set it aside Okay guys, so right now I'm just gonna start the sauce for my wings. We're just gonna start by adding the butter. We're gonna saute the butter and turn the heat down because you don't want the butter to burn. I think a stick of butter will do it. Okay guys, so what I'm going to do, I have some mangoes over here. It's about half of a mango, large mango. Okay guys, I have half of the mango here. You don't need more than that. And I have the mango chutney. So I want to get the sauce very smooth. So what I'm going to do guys is just put it in a neutral bullet and just blend it a little bit. You can get mango chutney anywhere guys, any other supermarkets, in the jam section.
what it should look like, guys. I'm now gonna add my garlic to my butter and saute. While the garlic is being cooked, I'm just gonna add the Hennessy. And guys, this Hennessy was equivalent to a cup. And then we're gonna just let it come to a boil. Once it comes to a boil, you're gonna add your honey. Your mango mixture. This is gonna help to make it thick. tablespoons of sugar barbecue sauce little salt, black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder. And stir. So guys, you're just gonna let this cook on low for a little bit until the sauce comes together. Just turn it off and set it aside. And guys, the sauce is so delicious coming from your Jamaican taste buds kitchen. And now that the sauce is ready, I'm just gonna set it aside. These are just the garlic that I minced and they're just sitting in the sauce. So I'm just gonna let this sit aside and continue my chicken wings. Okay guys, so for the baked wings, I'm gonna just pour a little bit of oil on the wings so that the sauce, so that the marinade would stick together and the wings would have some type of moisture to bring it together. So guys, these holes that I made, it's because I want the liquid from the chicken to drain into the hole so it doesn't sit in a pan of liquid because you want to get these chicken wings nice and crispy and brown and guys what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna bake these for a total of 45 minutes or until they're golden brown 22 minutes or 22 and a half minutes on one side and the same on the next so I'm just gonna pop these in the oven right now and then we're gonna start our fried chicken wings so guys what I'm gonna do now is just transfer the wings into this Ziploc bag and the reason why I do it like this is because whole process is gonna be less messy and you don't really have to get your hands all dirty
guys, after 22 minutes, that's what the chicken looks like. And now you're gonna turn it over on the other side. Let it cook for another 22 minutes. So in all, it's gonna be cooking for about 45 minutes, guys. We're gonna just pop this right back in the oven and see you in another 22 minutes. Okay guys, so my fried chicken wings are done. And you see how golden brown they are? And I'm gonna take them, put them on this plate so that they could, so the oil could drain. I can't wait to dig into these wings, guys. Coming to you from the Jamaican Taste Buds Kitchen. Mm-mm-mm. See how they look, guys? Okay, guys, I'm just gonna add the wings that I baked to my mango Hennessy sauce while it's hot so that it could soak up all that sauce guys that's what I'll be doing and let it rest for about five minutes guys I'm just gonna add the fried chicken wings to the sauce also everything is gonna get soaked up everything gonna just plate this now this is the finished product my mango Hennessy wings look at that coming from the Jamaican taste buds kitchen I got my baked version over here and then over here I got my deep fried version you know what guys I should have left a part of it so you could see the fried chicken and then guys I'm pairing this with some fried potato wedges guys I'm sure listen man try this recipe and let me know what you guys think look at how scrumptious that look guys look at how scrumptious these wings look guys trust me they are to die for guys it's a hit it's gonna be a hit because you know it's for season in America and this is the perfect appetizer to watch those games while stretched out on the couch. So guys, coming to you from the Jamaican taste buds can try this recipe and let me know what you think of my mango Hennessy chicken wings.